Hello everyone, this is a short explanation of the magnification mode, specifically when we're talking about II systems. II systems, uh, II stands for image intensifying systems. The mag button is also, um, this mode is also called electron magnification. I think that term is confusing because it can be confused with electron gain and also the uh, electron magnification can be confused with uh, something else that we use in, in flat panel systems and, and therefore I think it's better just to uh, refer to it as magnification mode and when they talk to you about magnification mode they really need to tell you whether you're dealing with a with an image intensifying system or uh, a flat panel detector system so therefore I don't think you need to worry a lot about the terminology just know that uh, magnification mode for II systems is specific for this type of system and, and therefore you shouldn't apply the concepts learned here elsewhere. This diagram shows a typical image intensifier tube. The yellow portion here, here will represent the input phosphor uh, or the input layer then you have the actual tube and the smaller piece here is the anode and your image is generated here so you have the x-rays coming from the bottom and hitting the yellow material and this uh, the first image is actually our standard setting then when we press the magnification button what happens is that our input phosphor the the field of view is decrease and you can see by that decrease in size when we uh, accelerate the electrons towards the anode the the size will correspond more to a one-to-one -one ratio therefore you don't have the minification that happens as part of our normal process in which you go from a bigger surface area to a smaller surface area the resolution formula the this one it's uh, line pairs over field of view and in this case you can see why magnification not only magnifies your image since you're displaying a smaller anatomical surface at a at a bigger screen you know your now your entire screen will be occupied by this smaller anatomic section but also you have an increase in the uh, resolution by decreasing the field of view and that is something that's very specific to image intensifying uh, tubes. The other aspect that's important when you do this magnification mode is that because you have a smaller light source, you will need to increase the radiation dose to the patient. Uh, this is usually done automatically nowadays by the ABC system. The ABC is, uh, stands for automatic brightness control and that brightness control is a light sensor that will detect there's a need for increased uh, radiation or increased number of photons usually achieved uh, by increasing your MA uh, but it can also increase KVP for the most part you should be aware that there's an increased radiation anytime you're doing magnification you can see that magnification is done by decreasing the size of the input and therefore uh, you will have uh, you won't have minification at the anode and the overall effect is increasing resolution and increasing size of what you're visualizing again be aware that electronic magnification in the image intensifier system has nothing to do with it being either digital or being a flat panel detector. I think this is confusing, but a lot of textbooks refer to it this way, so be aware uh, of, of that difference. Finally, uh, I wanted to talk about the ideal system. The ideal system is really uh, one that, in theory, would have a very small field of view. You would have a large number of line pairs, therefore uh, improving your resolution and having fast electronics which means you would have an adequate uh, refresh rate remember 
this system is used for fluoroscopy. Therefore, we want to be able to image real time and we we do want high resolution, but we cannot limit our, our frame rates uh, per second or frames per second in order to achieve a super high resolution. Uh, remember when I talked about the, the dose, um, the dose for, for uh, this type of uh, image intensifying tubes, when you decrease the, the field of view, you really have what happens is you're um, increasing the dose at that specific point. But if we go back to, to this part, you can see that I might be increasing it at this small point, but in terms of the overall radiation that's being delivered, we're, we're not necessarily uh, increasing it that much. Um, I don't think you need to know this level of details, but uh, have in mind that when you we talk about radiation or exposure in fluoroscopy, we're usually concerned about skin dose, and that skin dose is def, uh, different from organ dose. The skin dose is considered a deterministic effect and we follow a deterministic model for calculating what amount of skin dose might be dangerous. And the stochastic effect, which is mainly due to uh, breakage in your DNA, is related to the overall dose that's delivered to the organs. Um, so I think this is a, a very short summary, but it explains an important concept of magnification mode for image intensifier tubes.